Meanwhile, EOG professor Dr. Ron McNinch plans to file an ethics complaint with the EOG Faculty Senate to consider removing fellow professor Dr. Michael Ellert as a member. Ellert is a psychology professor who was suspended because of a sexual harassment complaint. Not only is he a professor, he also represents the College of Liberal Arts and Social Sciences on the Senate's General Education Review Committee. McNinch attempted to file the complaint at the UOG Faculty Senate meeting yesterday. However, it was denied because he didn't follow the correct procedure of filing a complaint. McNinch says he will try to file again. My complaint to the UOG Faculty Senate is that Mike Ellert violated certain ethical guidelines as a faculty member. Under UOG faculty ethics standards, this is a cause for him to be reviewed and punished if it's determined that he needs to be punished. I think since there's an adverse action, there should be no question that he should be considered to be removed from his faculty position, given that this has already went through a process and we know, and it's been made public, that he's been suspended by the university. UOG President Dr. Robert Underwood tells PNC that the UOG Faculty Senate, although associated with the university, runs as an independent body. He says it will be up to the Senate if they choose to remove or keep Ellert as a member.